Hello everyone, nice to see you again. I am RK. In this Linux series, our next video is about T command. When we try to save the output of any command to a file, we use greater than symbol with the file to save that. The output will be saved to the file, but it didn't display in the terminal. So sometimes we need to display the output in the terminal and also save it in the file. So for that, we can use the T command. We can't use the T directly. We need to use it with some other commands using pipe. Now I'm trying to display the password file. Here, this is the password file. Let's save it to a new file. Here you can see the output of the password file is stored in the b.txt, but it doesn't display any output in the terminal. Let's display b.txt. Here you can see that. Now let's use t command to save the output. We need to use pipe and t. Here you need to give the file name pass.txt. Here you can see it displays the output in the terminal and it also saves the output in pass file. Let's display that. Here it is. And instead of saving the output to one file, we can save it to a multiple files like ab.txt, cd.txt. Let's display both ab.txt and cd.txt. Here you can see that this is the content in cd.txt and this is the content in ab.txt and we can also append or write some more content in a file without deleting or overwriting that here i'm using my host file cat etc slash host and t to append we need to use the a flag and the file name file name is pass dot txt here you can see that this is the content in my host file let's open the pass.txt here we got host file content and here password file content and if we need to hide the output we can use the greater than symbol like cat slash etc slash host t and the file name is file.txt and greater than and we need to use a null file here it didn't show the output but the content of the host file is stored in the file.txt cat file.txt so that's it about t command if you have any doubts ask me in the comment section i will try to clear it and thanks for watching see you in the next video bye